Hi, my name is Charlotte Reynolds and I'm a student at Harper Adams University in the United Kingdom. For my honours research project, I took it as a sign when the United Nations declared 2016 as the International Year of Pulses that I should focus my attention on exploring new product development using a sustainable pulse ingredient. And so my journey began. It has been a fascinating discovery of the many varieties of pulses and the important role they play in international nutrition and cuisine. But upon discovering lupins, my excitement grew learning about their superfood status and yet their underutilisation in the food industry. From analysing the nutritional and functionality credentials, Lupins tick all the boxes with current market trends as well as concerns towards finding sustainable sources of dietary protein. So today I am presenting you Blooming Foods hand-baked lupin crisps. Each packet is made from over 60% sweet lupin. These crisps offer a high protein, low calorie and gluten free snack that not only tastes incredible, is good for you but is also good for planet earth. I really like the amount of calories in the portion. I really like the taste of the crisps, I think they're really more rich. Really nice crisps, low in calories, really nice flavour to them and I can see them being paired really nicely with um, cheese instead of crackers. So they have a lot to offer. Firstly they would be gluten free, so they would appeal to the market for people on a restricted diet. The crop itself is lupins, is a very sustainable crop and it has quite an appeal within that because there are people who are more interested or taking more interest in the sustainability of their food supplies. They're reasonably high in protein, so there may be a marketing opportunity for saying that uh, protein is good for satiety, they'd be quite filling. They're very low in calories, so they would be well suited again to people who don't want to indulge in a lot of calories, and they are very low in fat. The formulation's been really simple. It's simply the lupin flour, and uh, the other main component is potato starch, which could be used as a byproduct of the potato processing industry. So it's another element to sustainability. They're very simple, easily baked. There's a little bit to do in terms of producing consistency. They've been very well reviewed by Charlotte's focus groups. They are really very flavoursome, even in an unflavoured state. So I think this product has a lot of potential. Blooming Foods Lupin Crisps has great potential in addressing future dietary protein concerns and consumer demands all in a Moorish snack. Thank you for watching.